For the first 33 years of my life, I lived in the Midwest, Chicago suburbs, which meant, like many of you, it was about three hours away to my closest outdoor climbing. Now that I live in Colorado, I've got quality climbing all around me, as close as 17 minutes away. Now, I don't say that only to brag, but also to make a point. It takes something really amazing now for me to want to drive three hours and give up my whole weekend, but Independence Pass is amazing. See a stream your face when you lose something you cannot replace. See a stream your face. May not be surprised to find out that we're running just a touch late. It's supposed to be leaving between 7 and 8 a.m. and it's about 9.02. They're so funny just sitting at the door together. You guys both get to come. <laughs> just like I planned. What's up, baby? What's up, Rogi? I wonder how they got there. <laughs> Some nerd must have left them. He looks so crazy, buddy. Why do you look so crazy right now? Okay, see you in a sec. You wanna get in and then I'll cut him with you? Sure. Yeah. Stop that ball. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I can let you out. I got this. I'm a chai tea latte with a shot of espresso and oat milk. Yep. Yeah, you're good. I'm like wondering, like, do we get a pup cup? We do not. And here's that chai Thank for you. you. Have yeah. a good one. Sorry. Sorry, I woke you up. Sorry to upset your beauty nap. You kept it going. Uh -huh. No, I did. I got the shot I wanted. Yeah, and then I came back in on a little cute little road. Now, quite the view for a gas station, huh? Not the worst. Been considering growing out a nice Santa beard for Christmas. I'm gonna ask you what you think, but you were pretty quick to say no before I even ask. All I want to do is grow it out and dye it white and then shave it after Christmas. Horrible. <laughs> Last trip to Independence Pass this season. It's September 23rd, I think. First weekend of fall. Oh, gotta go around dumps. Around this way, buddy. And uh, it's gonna get me snowing up here any day. Yeah, I don't know. Not sure if they're camping or living. We might want to make our way down into that, I think. According to the map on Mountain Project, we're getting very close to the egg. The GPS coordinates are often crap, though. We should be close. You could do it, buddy. Come on. Come on. He's sliding. Come on, buddy. Yeah, there's your favorite, Oh. Dude, sorry, man. We're really late. Oh, you know? no worries. 
Yeah, mostly for me here at the end, bushwhacking us for the last 45 minutes. Really? I found the trail perfectly, you know, per yeah, your you directions. Can't follow the trail. That was great. And I stayed on it most of the way and then saw like on the map and I'm like, cool. And we started heading towards it. And I'm like, where the fuck are we, man? Went yeah. So I went down nice. into the gully and then dug back up and. Caroline and I have just started sending V6 in the last handful of months, really. So a send of this Independence Pass Classic would be quite the souvenir. You know what they say about Independence Pass Classics. When you try Come on. Best, but you don't succeed. Oh. Foot slip is too. When you get what you want, but not what you need. When you feel so tired, but you can't sleep. Stuck in river. Nice. Yeah. Ooh, the, the readjust. Yeah. Nice work. I wasn't in it all the way. Nice way to get it. Something you can't replace. You love so oh, I just yeah, missed the good, good spot. That's I felt the good, good spot. I was up like a half inch or an inch. Yes, come on, stick with it. Yeah, <laughs> oh, a little too stretched. I gotta figure out something else. When she jumped down, he was so alone. And she was like, whoa. <laughs> What are you doing? Um, the plan that I'm 100% sticking to you will be cross the left like I usually do, bump the right, take the high left, cross the left up into the slot, up and out for the right, hold that position with the higher right foot, bump into the crux, take a left foot and beyond. That's the plan. All right, stick to the plan. Stick to the plan. Same move, hit the crux. Same move, hit the crux. Okay. Good, come on. Yep, you're there. Got it, babe. Yeah. Yep, get, yep, perfect. Get that right foot up. Yep, to the pen. Yeah. Yeah. Find a foot. You got it. Good hold. Yep, exactly. Nice, Justin. Yeah, you're there. You're there. Woo! Nice. Good, there. Come on. Yeah, go on the left. There's a really good foot that way. Okay. Really good job, that thing I was like hyperventilating for 20-30 seconds because I was like holding my breath and like stressing out so I just laid there for like 30 seconds just like, <sighs> like yeah dude where you feel it where it's like I can't do enough breaths to catch up Lights will 
I'm not gonna lie, you didn't make the cop look pretty, but you got through it. Oh my god. Oh, did yes. you have to go? Close it out, baby. Just Dig. It. Justin, do you know how to get down? Um, no, I don't. <laughs> You'll figure it out. I was just <laughs> resting. <laughs> yeah, I'll figure it out. I said I wanted some more V5s. There's one, classic. That's right, dude. Single session and a highball. A little birdie told me the egg hasn't seen the last of Caroline. Stick around. Who's that? Yo, what? Oh, croissants. Yeah. I like it. You've inspired us. <laughs> We've really never like stopped eating croissants ever really? since you brought them that one time. <laughs> it is excellent for a breakfast sandwich. It is. Yeah. It's, it's a lot lighter than the bagel. Yeah, so totally. The bagel can be a little hard to finish. Yeah, time for a little breakfast sandwich. I have a bite of Justin's chocolate French toast or whatever, or croissant French toast. And I was like, oh, I need one of those. You're on your own order. <laughs> and, like ate one of those and then ate like four of those like 2,000 calorie uh, ice cream sandwiches right after it, you know? Yeah, the, that's it, right? Those fat, the chunky ones. Chocolate coated oatmeal cookies. The night you had like the nine ice cream like sandwiches, it was the night days. you got in, and yeah, the yeah, next day I think is when we took you. Right. <laughs> like the next morning you went and got the French toast, yeah. <laughs> you hadn't even gotten the ice cream sandwiches out of your system yet. Yeah. <laughs> like you're Today's the day I'll make you mine. The sun is rising. Stop now. I know they're gonna go back to it. Morning, good morning, rise and shine. This first site five, you park right next to that camp spot, and hopefully there's just not people there, so you're not like walking through their camp spot. Right. Well, if they're camping, there. there's a good chance they're not gonna like be there now necessarily in the middle of the day they That's might be true. out doing something mm -hmm. right hiking or More than whatever likely. you know like a classic three a classic four a classic just five i feel like, like that what you just said is like all five it's like a three five. which is really a five a four which is really a five and then a six which is really a six right. what we're thinking is like we'll head in and grab some coffee or whatever in aspen after this half hour in half hour out half hour for coffee half hour buffer be more two hours two hours and 15 minutes to meet you at the camp Five oh, spot. Oh, if that works go. for you guys. Oh. Thompson, hey! Why are you doing that? There's a dog over there, but that's not a reason. There's dogs everywhere. <laughs> they just have to do that every time there's a dog, you know? Anxious? There it is. 
Good work. Thank you. Sorry, I'm a little tight on you here. I'm gonna rotate around. Pyramid. Excellent boulder. Uh, is that, how many stars do they give that? Three or four? It's like five nine V zero, so it's not. Not the easiest V zero out yeah, there. Like kind of smeary feet, kind of bouncy at the start. You know? Sure. One is unfair. Dude, I mean, with the setting, it's like, what? That guidebook a-hole gave it one star. A great setting and aesthetic climb, good climbing at the V-Zero grade. Like, what do you want? Top down, I feel like it looks taller than like the bottom up shot did. Right. It looks pretty cool. Sweet. Good work. I know one star <laughs> means worth doing, but still, come on. Okay, the pyramid. Highly recommend. I'm glad to climb it first when it's not. But I would love to come back and climb this over the water yeah, that'd be nice. now that we'll have done it, you know, already. Oh my God, Robbie. You're so good at it, baby. Wow, look at you, your first climb. What's it go at? at least we're getting out how to come down too. Yeah, he's down, oh! Not the most graceful, but. Not the worst. Good job, buddy. Good job. You're a little climber. What do you think, Dempson? Pretty cute little guy, huh? Dempson, mm. why can't you do that, dude? <laughs> I could if I want it. Says it has a slopey top out, so I'm a little concerned. <laughs> Based on the slopey need. How the slopers felt over there. It's like a pretty big move in the way, so. Yeah, that's at least something. At the far end of that reach. Yeah. Next to that little black splotch. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I was like, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ow. Oh. They were in a crack Lay and up. they got caught in the crack and I bent this finger particularly. Nice dude. <sighs> cool. Good work, man. Thank you. Yeah, it's that that next hold. Is not, it's a sloper. Not that good. In case you hadn't noticed, I'm spotting instead of filming. I really don't prefer it, but. <laughs> you can get your weight onto that right foot. It's looking good. This top out is pretty sketchy. Do it again so I can film it from here. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, dude. Nice work. 
Spatula City, V6. <laughs> Spatula City, huh? Spatula City. What's that about? Omelet. It's actually a three star. Oh, it fits with the naming convention, okay. Yeah, that top. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I was like in the point where I was like, there is no return though. You know what I mean? Right. Like, it's like once I was up on the slopers, there's no like going back down and jumping off. Like, <laughs> right, no. Right, dude. Yeah. Yeah, reversing that like mantly sloper move. <laughs> oh man. I like it. Well, babes, where'd you put my phone? I don't think you can hear you. Babe. Yeah. Justin definitely just came and stole my pillow. Did you just send it, Justin? No. But I did a couple of the hard moves, I think. Nice. So, I think it'll go after a little rest and one or a couple of tries. Yeah, that lower foot feels very nice. Yeah, looks good. Nice. There's a, little, there's a little foot chip right at your hip. Get the left there if you can. Nice. There you go. Nice. Yeah. Not to the jug. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sweet. Oh, my God. I just, like, like, uh -huh. I did not get the foot chip. <laughs> Dude, good work. That was fast. Oh. Yeah. I just, like, Campus nice work. Cool. Full send. <laughs> Good work, Caroline. She's always got me beat on the crimps. <laughs> I'm like barely even warmed up enough to be crimping on this thing through the crux. Give it a go. This is almost the end of the video, but not quite the end of the story. Caroline and the Egg still have some unfinished business to attend to. We're trying hard over this next decade to make a career out of this channel, so please give me feedback or any ideas you have for how I can improve. Thanks for watching. Nice. Yeah, come on. You got it. Nice, babe. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, come on. Yep. Find, a, find some feet. They're there. Yep, exactly. Yep. And then find a right foot right after that. Yep, up to there. There you go. Nice, babe. Nice. Out left is a good jug. Yeah.